Yeah, these are some of my favorite segments because I don't have to wear the clothing for the part I normally do on Know the Cause. Dr. Len Lopez, good buddy of mine. We must have met 20 years ago yeah, or so. About and that. Had lunch together. He used to listen to my radio show. At that time, you were single. So getting up at 7 in the morning listening to that show was a big feat. Back 20 years then. ago, that was a child prodigy, too. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> we both were. Now married three children, three twins kids. and yes. another. And, wow. and a little boy also. Lynn, that's yeah. so great. Oh, Congratulations. That's the best. I mean, life just it gets better and better. Lynn and I met recently again at a Help Fest out here in Dallas. Right. I was speaking. You had a booth right next right. to where I was speaking. And I learned about this. It's called a workhorse. It uh, comes in a little box, just like you see. That's not trash. That's actually no. your box. We thought they left some <laughs> trash on the set. But that is the box that it comes in, little light thing. Uh, this is amazing. With a couple of fingers, yet it's steel. It is so strong. Tell us what this is. Well, what, what, I, what I learned, you know, doing, lots of my patients come in for you because know, I do sports medicine, is that we're overworking one set of muscles and not enough of the other muscles. Everybody can do push-ups. I mean, we've seen yeah. infomercials talking about, well, you can do some kind of push-ups. <laughs> yeah. But a lot of people are neglecting half their upper body because they can't do pull-ups, okay? Mm. And push-ups and pull-ups, both exercises, if you do both of them, you work all your major muscles of, of your upper body. So I created the workhorse, and really what the workhorse does is that it allows you to do those two basic exercises, push-ups and pull-ups. Mm -hmm. And, you know, the push-up handles are down here. It allows you to take some stress off your wrist so you don't do them like this because they yeah, really... Yeah. Which is the way I'm doing them, by the way. And it is hard on your wrist. It is hard yeah. on your wrist. And so it allows you just to get that nice, deep stretch to do push-ups on here. But the real benefit of the workhorse that I think why so many people really do appreciate it is the fact that you can do pull-ups on it. Okay. What, what I'm doing You're here lame. is yeah. I'm doing a modified pull-up. Instead, instead of me trying to pull up 180 pounds... For a lot of people, that's pretty hard to do. But here, I'm only, t I'm only pulling up about 120 pounds. So now I can work my back, my biceps, and my forearm, the muscles that most people seem to neglect if they work out at home. Is the back. You know, yeah. everybody wants to look great in the front. The and pretty then, muscles. Right, the pretty muscles. And then you turn around, and it's all flabby. This exercises both of them. Let me, let me try this. Boy, did I get a workout last night. Oh, okay, so... You don't have to worry about this thing falling over on you. No. It's very, very sturdy. And again, it allows you to do both push-ups and pull-ups. And when we do a little five-minute workout, that if you do a five-minute workout with the workhorse, you'll work every major muscle of your upper body and get that nice... Yeah, again, we're, we're trying to add some shape and tone to your body. But really, so many of the people that I see have upper back and neck pain yep, because yep. they're not doing any pulling exercises. So this, this I kind of like. Now, just lift your hips... Right there, and all that of a sudden, position, pull up to the chest. I don't have to there lift. Okay, come out. Good. Just like that. Ooh, that's easy. Well, I don't know how much you weigh, but I'm assuming about 180 pounds. 175, yeah. 175 pounds. So I don't know how hard it is for you to try to pull yourself to do 175 no, pounds. No, Lynn, that's the problem. That's why I loved this when I saw it at the symposium. Um, anybody that weighs 175 pounds, you're pulling up with chin ups 175 pounds. And that's difficult when you get into your 60s. Most women can't do pull-ups. Yeah. Most men, when they've added a few years or a few pounds, can't do a freestanding pull-up either. But if you offload a third of your body weight with the workhorse, now everybody can get the same benefit of that pulling motion. Because, again, when you do a push-up, yep. you work your chest, your shoulders, and your triceps. When you do any kind of a pulling motion, now you work on your back your biceps and your forearm. And so the workhorse just allows you to offload a third of your body weight. It, as you were showing, it's lightweight and portable. When you're mm. finished working out, just pull the, pull the prongs out. You can just kind of fold it up, take it out of the way. Store it away. Store it away underneath the bed, uh, behind the uh, against the closet. When you're ready to work out again, just pop it up. I love this thing. The reason I wanted Dr. Lopez to come on, number one, to reacquaint our oh. relationship. Great to see you again, that's, man. That's best. And number two, this machine is $99. You right. see a lot of these for $159, $200. And if I catch any of you hanging your pajamas on this, it's going to come back to Dr. Lopez. You can get uh, call the phone number and uh, get a lot of information on this. Great to see you again. This was really a double joy for me. It's called the Workhorse. Call, pick up one of these. You're going to love it. Thanks. Thank you, Dr. Lopez. Thanks, Doc. Appreciate it.